placings are complete in our junior three-year-old class. Our production award winner is entry 3292, Sandy Valley Atwood Blackie, exhibited by Mike and Julie Duckett and David Diamond of Rudolph, Wisconsin. Third place is entry 3310, BVK Atwood Andrea, exhibited by Alan Lloyd and Heath of Canaan, Connecticut. Second in the class, and first bred and known, entry 3314, BVK Atwood Abriana, exhibited by Jeffrey Butler of Shabans, Illinois. And our winning entry, and first best utter, entry 3304, Airhort Gold Beauty, exhibited by Milk Source Genetics of Kakana, Wisconsin. Congratulations. Judge your comments. Well, I think you ought to give this class one more round of applause right to the bottom. Just an incredible group of others out here. And these first six, when they come to the top of the ring, they come there fast. They're the kind of cows I like. They excel in that frame. They've got quality the whole way through. They've got dairy strength. And the cow that starts the class puts it all together for me today. She's a beautiful side view cow. She's got a big uphill run. She's just got a little more natural dairy look to her when you view her from the side, a little cleaner about the sweep of her rib, just a little more balanced the whole way through when she's out here on the move. And then she's got that beautiful capacious udder. You love the venation to the fore udder, the height, the width of the rear udder. I just prefer the shape to her rear today a touch bit over the cow coming out here in second. Cow in second follows that pattern though. She's got that uphill run. You love the beautiful whisk she has through the chest floor. Maybe a touch bit stronger cow, but she's got quality to go with it. She moves out on a tremendous set of feet and legs. You love the quality to the mammary system. And she uses that advantage in her mammary system today over a real similar cow coming out here in third. Cow in third follows the pattern of the first two. The beautiful uphill run, the big open barrel. You love the drop to the rear flank. A cow for me today, it's just got a little more lift up through her front end, a little more motor the whole way through. And when you get her in line here, she just overwhelms her fourth place cow a little bit on that size and scale. Taking nothing away from the cow in force. She's a beautiful uttered cow. A cow that's really stylish when she's out on the move. You love the cleanliness that she has the whole way through. Just a little freer moving for me on her hind legs today than the real silky dairy cow we have coming here in fifth. Cow in fifth, another cow who excels in mammary system. You love the quality to the udder, the beautiful height and the width to the rear udder. I prefer the, the definition of seam on the cow coming out here in fifth. Just a little more quality the whole way through her mammary system and a little more femininity the whole way through over the real upstanding cow we have following in sixth. 